brushed my tan off now so I'm looking nowhere near as brown although I still do look really brown so I am now going to do my makeup I actually need to get the train a little bit earlier than I was planning because apparently the queue is like really really long and Holly is already in the queue so I've got to get there like really really early so I'm gonna literally get ready now and then hopefully get the train about three-ish instead so I'm just gonna do my makeup and then I will get back to you update i've done my eyeliner so sharp and i'm literally so proud of myself this one's got a little bit thicker than that one like this one is my favorite eyeliner that i've ever done um also my mirror just fell off my sophie palette so i'm just using this um yeah maybe i should make the other one thicker to like match it but i'm so happy i'm actually gonna put on lashes as well for the first time in like months you know i'm going like proper in with my makeup when i do extra baking i've just done my contour and i'm baking here and here and i've also put some on my nose as well because i'm gonna do freckles again and now yeah i'm just waiting for it to bake i'm literally just so excited i'm listening to the whole sweetener album on repeat i've been listening to it all morning on repeat but i just i'm so excited i know i keep saying that you're probably thinking anna stop saying that now we know you're excited but i literally I just am. And I am finished getting ready. I've just done my makeup and I've curled my hair. I mean, no my luck. It will probably all drop out by the time I get there. Um, and then I've just got on my two necklaces. I've got on my Anastasia one from Chamois. And then I've got on this little Louis Vuitton one from, I think it's called La Rue Jewels. I'll leave it down below. Then I've got on my shirt from Urban Outfitters. And I've got on these really cool, like, tie waist blue mum jeans, which are from, I saw it first. I love them so, so much. I think these are so cool and quirky. So I'm going to be wearing these. I just love how they've got like a Thai paper bag waist. They're just a little bit extra. Do you know what I mean? But yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm so excited. Everybody's ordering Uber Eats to the queue. So you know what I'll be doing when I get there. Fully ordering McDonald's. So I'm waiting in the queue for Ariana. Hi. And I've got the lovely viewers. Are you excited, Ariana? I'm so excited. I'm so excited.
morning everybody so i have got a little bit of a story time for you because the last time i filmed last night was literally ariana and then literally it just took a turn so i actually passed out in the audience like fully blacked out like i don't remember it happening um basically all i remember is i turned to holly who i was with and i said i really don't feel well i need to get out of the audience and that's literally the last thing i remember and then i remember waking up on the floor and i could just feel like cold concrete on my head and i was thinking and i remember thinking oh my god like what's that at and then i remember coming around and i was like laying on the floor but like it didn't click with my head that i was like on the floor i dropped my phone and camera and i think that was like my first thought i was like oh my god where's my phone and camera um, and then I just remember this mum trying to help me and give me water, but I wasn't with it enough um, to understand what she was like doing. But I remember looking at her and thinking that's what she was trying to do. Um, and then Holly grabbed me out. Loads of people were helping me out. Like as soon as I passed out, everybody was helping me. Um, and then I was sat with two paramedics for maybe like 15 minutes. Um, and basically, I didn't realise until I'd got out, um, I was at the tube station after like getting the tube because um, I felt fine like half an hour after um, and I'd actually like cut my lip really really bad when I fell down. I'd obviously bit it or like hit it on the floor, I don't really know what happened um, but I've got like a massive cut here and then like a cut inside my lip as well so it is a little bit swollen and it does hurt a little bit so if you can really see it like I know it's really annoying. I'm going to put lipstick on it so you can't see it obviously when I'm ready. Um, but that's what happened and it's so sad because the one song that I was like most excited to see was Breathe In. It was literally just as she finished the last song that like I don't even remember what it was. She was just about to do Breathe In um, and then obviously I wasn't even conscious for it so that happened i think it was just ridiculously hot in there and i never fully blacked out before like i'd a little pump at wireless i kind of was in the state of i was still there and i knew what was going on um but i still like i but because obviously i got dragged out if you didn't watch the video <laughs> love myself at concerts like i was still with it enough to understand like i managed to walk fairly straight off whereas with this i fully like went down to the ground blacked out i don't remember it happening it was just a really scary thing because i've never like blacked out before and to like know that i lost that amount of time is really scary to me um apparently i was literally only on the floor for like not even a few seconds like it was literally a few seconds i was gone for because that's the thing i was really paranoid about i was like how long was i there like i get really embarrassed and i'm so embarrassed because i know there were so many of you guys as well that were around me because i met so many people last night and everybody was coming up to me like are you okay i know that you passed out and it was just like i don't know i was just i was so embarrassed but it was my own fault it was super hot in there and i just didn't have any water and i just be honest once i got my place like near the front i just really didn't want to move from that place just because i was so excited um but then obviously that happened so now i have learnt my lesson the hard way and i know that i'm always going to drink water at concerts and i think i was just standing for too long and yeah i don't know i think it just all kind of like finished me but it's so annoying because it's happened at the last two concerts i've been to now like wireless obviously little pump i didn't fully go but then obviously ariana i fully went so i literally i could not stop apologizing to holly who had obviously taken me because i just felt so bad because like she'd taken me with her and i just i felt so awful um but she was so so lovely she actually took a picture of me when i'd come around with the water because i was like take a picture of me so i could put it in my vlog um and she took a picture of me and then I, at this point i still didn't know i had a cut lip but you can see it in the picture like you can just see that like, the red line um and it did hurt like my whole head kind of hurt but i just presumed that it was because i'd like gone down and i felt dizzy but it was really weird because before i went like i knew i was gonna go it just happened so quick like i felt really hot and really sick like really sick i rarely feel sick touch wood don't want to start feeling sick um but i rarely do and i literally just felt like i was gonna throw up everywhere um and then i remember starting to shake like really badly starting to shake i remember looking at this hand and it was just going like that bang i was gone like that was literally it what happened um so my lip does actually really really hurt i'm gonna put some ice on it because yeah like it does really hurt um but i just didn't realize until 
uh, when was it? The two lovely girls could come up to me at the tube station and we were just having a chat and then they said it and I didn't even realise until then and I thought it was a chap lip at first. I was like, oh no, it's just my chap lip. Like I've just like, you know, gone through a lot. Um, but no. So yeah, that's basically what happened. But other than that, I had an amazing night. She was insane. I obviously got like uh, quite a bit of footage, I think, from before I passed out. I'm not sure how much I got, but I think I got quite a bit. Um, so thank you so much to Holly for taking me. Like genuinely, it means the world to me. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. And I had an amazing night other than that. Also, I have woken up this morning and I have hit 500,000 subscribers. I'm actually going to talk about it in like today's vlog because I'm going to end this vlog here but I just wanted to say a quick thank you because I'm still in shock and like this has literally made my week after like that last night and really scaring myself that has literally made which made my life so thank you so so much like genuinely means the world to me so I'm going to end this vlog here I hope you guys enjoyed and took my little story time to end it off um, I accidentally think I deleted the intro to this vlog um, when I was uh, trying to clear space on my memory card because um, I wanted to film with Ariana and I think I might have deleted the intro so I'm so sorry um, but thank you so much for watching I really hope you guys have enjoyed and I will see you tomorrow at 6pm for a brand new vlog Mwah. bye <laughs>